Hi everyone, it's Laura with Contessa Creations. I'm here to share um, a couple of swaps that I did. One is um, from 1966 Allison Stick Pin Swap, and that was my pin that I made. And I used um, this die. It looked like a dress form to me. They had them clearanced at Michael's for $4.99, so I thought that was really, really cute. Um, and it came with this dress too, so um, I just thought that was really cute. And I just sandwiched it between chipboard and glittery cardstock, and then I put a row of um, bling right there. So anyway, I just I love the way that those turned out. So that's for that swap. And then this one is from my swap. This is um, let me put it on this. this is oh, that's not looking so good. From um, yourpaperpantry.ning.com, and I don't know if you can see, I have these little birds that I put on um, these flowers. So I thought it looked like he was nesting, and it's an angel, and then just a cool-looking square. But what I did was I sandwiched again. I sandwiched between ch uh, chipboard and cardstock, and I glimmer misted it, and I put two brads in the heart um, circle. Uh, Hello, flower circles, and um, I used this die for that one. So I am having so much fun doing these. It's I don't know if I'm having more fun with the stick pins or trying to figure out what to stick them in. So there you go. Those are the fine tip details. <laughs> anyway, so let me know what you think. And then this one is Bona's um, Graphic 45 um, Halloween and Wonderland mini that I did. Um, this time she had us use, um, there was the broke, the ornamental, and square, and I chose, um, I can't remember what that one's called, the, I think it's the ornamental. Anyway, so what I did with this is the challenge was distress, um, distress powder, so, um, or I'm sorry, embossing powder, so I embossed it with distressed black soot. I used the, um, Sizzix. Spider web, and I used that as a pocket. And these are my two little tags. And this paper is called Your Late. Um, I had a really fun time doing this. And this is a recollection spider brad that I just cut off the um, back part. Little spider, I don't know if you can see that. It's really cute. And then I just put some Prima Bling as its web. And these are the recollection flowers. Um, it looks like they have little spiders on them. So I actually ran out of um, this particular um, flower. So there was another orange, or no, this was actually white, and I glimmer misted it with, um, I forget what the name, with pumpkin pie. So it came out exactly how I wanted it. And then um, this is just some Making Memories um, spider web ribbon. But anyway, the other one that was in the pack, there were um, six in the pack, was orange, and it had skulls on it, but when I glimmer misted it, you couldn't see, so then I took a little tiny black um, stamp, and I stamped some spiders, so it turned out pretty cool. And then these are just, this is from the um, tags from uh, the Halloween and Wonderland line, and then this is just my tag with a little um, stamp that I got at Big Lots. So that's that side. And then this is my next side. And um, what was really fun about this one is I started out making this as a pumpkin. And then I realized on the back of this paper that it was a little um, pocket watch. So I turned my journaling slash picture spot into a little pocket watch. And this is just a, a toggle um, opening for a toggle bracelet, um, you know, little sticks that go in. And then I embossed it with um, the Tim Holtz clock stamp. And then here is just the, you know, journaling. Or, you know, you could put pictures or whatever. So I just had a blast making that one up. And this is a little bat from the Recollections um, little Brad set at Michael's. And then I wanted a pocket, so I thought it would be cute. I have this... Um, picket fence that I picked up on eBay. They don't make it anymore, but I just love this. You can do it for, you know, 
I don't know, all kinds of different things um, with gardens or Halloween or whatever. So I took a um, purple paper, the um, American Crafts that I got it Tuesday morning, and I spritzed it with Black Magic. And then I rubbed it with some um, black soot, um, gosh, I can't even talk to the Distress Ink. And then um, it was funny because there were different tags for this collection, and this one just happened to fit. And then I realized it said Magic Garden Book, and that's exactly what this whole thing reminds me of. And then there's the um, clock is behind. I can't think of what his name is. Oh, I'm crazy. Anyway, um, and then I found these pumpkins. They're um, dress it ups, and I clipped the back off, and then two prima flowers, and then some more of the making memories um, spider web. Um, ribbon. And then I distressed with um, black soot distress powder on the sides. So um, anyway, I had so much fun making this. I can't even tell you. Um, just just really fun. I, this is probably my favorite creation that I've made lately. So anyway, thanks Bona for hosting and um, in um, I don't know. I just, I just really love doing this one. So thank you again, and let me know what you guys think. Um, love reading your comments. Uh, keep creating. Have a good day. Bye.